What's up, guys? Um, it's time for another video. That's that's all I really wanted to say. So today we actually got Angel Feather Maluk Malek. Mm. A few things before I say anything about this deck is um I'm still trying to figure out the ways around this deck, like what to put, what not to put. So yeah, it's still in development. So we still going. We're going to have a part two with it. So, without further ado, here we go. Let's go, Angel. Yes, we're doing replays today. We're doing replays because replays are spicy. I do play one of, of um, the hospital boy, but I'm thinking of taking him out quickly. Um, this build is obviously, um, not better than the Gabriel build, you know, OTK, you, OTK, but it's still a pretty good build, still pretty good, so, um, the one thing I definitely like is I never have to take damage with, uh, Malek, Malek because of the second one that I usually put on top with either Holy Road Angel or the great one support, which is persistence angel. Okay. So I disc at this point I discard Maluk Maluk because I can always resurrect it to the top of my deck with persistence angel. Um, at certain points in this video, you will see times where I actually go for, I go for um, where I. Uh, ugh, I can't get words out today. Um. Yeah, I can't get words out today. So we we just going to go out. I just forgot what I was about to say. Whoops. But uh, look at this. I can't deal. It's like I can't deal with uh, decks that swarm me like this. I can't deal with it. I really wish this deck had like more options to uh, like more defensive. I wouldn't say defensive options because it has many defensive options. I wish this had a bigger hand set, hand size. I would like to say because if it had a bigger hand size, then that would be my spice. I do run Ep Amputation Angel, which I probably go and take out um, Feather Hospital for because I got four of these babies. And once you hit that three protect markers, which technically you always should hit with this deck, it's just so good. Um, Shit Malek Malek counts as a heal. It really does count as a heal trigger if you get like you have a card in hand and you're sitting on arc at certain points of time i wish i was on this i wish i could end the turn rewriting this but <clears throat> i i usually don't um at this point my um my opponent has kept on continuously hit me with uh this big old hand and i'm like what what is this? He has a hand and I don't. Um, I do make changes from the first match to the second, uh, but I will let y'all see that for yourself. Uh, my opponent thought he can attack with me with eighteen, but amputation angel gets all this power. You can only attack my vanguard. Thank you. Uh, and all the points I should have discarded the amputation, but mm, I didn't know what to do. Counter blast, heal one. Look at me at four damage. At this point, I really think I'm about to win. And obviously, I can re recycle. Technically, I only need 
one of this to continuously recycle because the soul blast was the soul blast from persistence angel with having to keep on soul blasting it out and stacking soul blast stack soul blast stack is just so good okay so at this point um i decided not to discard my malek malek because i thought oh maybe if i can just go into maybe if i can just um take this damage right here that i wouldn't have to no i ugh, i can't talk i can't talk somebody help me speak somebody help me with my english because i don't know mm. look at this i was about to win I was about to win, but because he has a big old hand, he guards. What is this? But yeah, once you get Amputation Angel out, it just goes so nuts. Everything is just so nuts. He had just enough to guard. Just enough. That makes me even more mad. He had just enough to guard. Everything was attacking for two crit, so I have to hope that he doesn't have at least one trigger. He attacks for 63. This is why I wish. This is why I wish I could have discarded, got, got into uh, Shin, and then checked another heal trigger. Ugh. So frustrating. Yeah, I just wish I had these nullifies in my hand. But let's let's get out of here. Um We do have another fight. I am such a noob with this deck. Ah oh, Jesus Christ. Uh send me send me y'all deck list. Send me y'all deck list. If y'all have a good deck list for this, I beg of you, please send it. I am such a noob. I am a noob. Please help. Going against Neo Nectar. The amount of cards that they got with this deck should be illegal. It should be. It just should be illegal. Mm. Attack. Check. Ella, now watch this. As soon as they get into grade two turn, Paul on top gets to draw. Paul, retire, draw again. Paul, counter blast, soul blast, call plant token, and draw. What's up with all this drawing? Jesus Christ. And plus the big power along with it too. Can I get a break? Please? I need a break. Just give me a break. Like Chance the Rapper? Okay, so, um, at this point, I wasn't, um, I wasn't finna, um, draw my luck. Like, I was just trying to make sure I at least had one in hand. Because I was going to discard it next turn. So, at this point, I'm just attacking the Vanguard. There's no point in attacking Rear Guard. For what? They already use their skill. Like, that's the thing with Neo Nectar. Most of them are just on place. If I could just get this to retire, if I could just retire this, this is why I play, this is why I play Dragon Empire. For times like this, where people want to swarm the field, I know it wouldn't do much against this clan, but you know, Jesus Christ. So I got this for two. They decide to switch it up. I guard the rest. Now look at this. I get back into the game. Ride Malak Malak. 
Counter Blast to recover one point of damage. Easy business. Stack Moloch Moloch. Then my Vanguard skill to Soul Blast. Resurrect the whole field. This is so good. I resurrect. I literally resurrected the whole field. But here's the thing. I discarded. I discarded my grade one. I don't even know if that would have helped. But it would have been better than all of this. I don't know. It would have been better than having this. Um, yeah. Person just went off. Once I'm on grade three, it's like, oh, you got, oh, you say you ain't got power? Can't relate. Ooh, he said, attack with that. Oh, easy guard. Easy guard. Now I'm thinking, all I need to do is take this attack and another attack, and I'm Gucci. But here he goes. Check critical trigger. Check heal trigger. I'm like, what the heck? all I have to say, what the heck? And at the end, I end off with both my luck, my likes, and the damage. And, and, uh, not the damage, so in my hand. Well, guys, um, I'm sorry for the terrible performance, but this has been a good fight and a good episode of God Fight Van X Please like, comment, and subscribe for more Car Fight Vanguard content. They call me Kiati, and I will see you guys in the next video.